Hey everyone, Aloha here, and I wanted to give you a quick demonstration of how you might use Wikipedia to help you narrow down a research topic and also to identify particular subtopics to write about within a research paper. So in this example, I had the idea to write about the topic of student loans. And I chose this topic because um, it is personally interesting to me, um, but it's a very large topic. So I would want to try and narrow this down because I can't just say I'm going to research student loans. What about them? Am I going to be researching and focusing on? So here's the Wikipedia page on student loans in the United States. And um, there's a helpful overview with some useful statistics at the top. But I like to look at the list of contents along the left hand side. And this is going to give me some ideas. So I'm going to scroll through and find something that looks interesting to me. The one that catches my eye is the one that says criticisms. And if I open that menu, here's a bunch of different examples of criticisms of student loans in the United States. And at the very bottom, I like the idea of consequences of student loan debt. So if I click on that, it's going to open up that section of the Wikipedia page. And here I'm seeing some specific examples of potential consequences that I might want to look into in my research or maybe even focus on for the paper. So something that jumps out right away is the last one, increased anxiety. That is a potential consequence of student loan debt. Now, I might be able to write an entire paper on just that one topic, anxiety related to student loan debt. Or maybe I want to write my paper on just generally the consequences of student loan debt. And then these would be examples that I brought up in the paper. So that's just one quick demonstration of how you might Use Wikipedia just to help you kind of come up with the examples or even the structure of what your paper might look like. And then you can use this information later on when you're actually doing your research. Okay, I hope that was helpful.